Kizaza kilizuka kwenye boma moja katika kijiji cha Kasavai eneo bunge la Ikolomani kaunti ya Kakamega baada ya wake wenza wawili ambao walikuwa wamewaleewa na mume mmoja kuzozania maiti ya mwanaume huyo. Mzao wangu alikufa, nimekuja matanga kwa boma yangu nimefungiwa. Mke wa kwanza Grace Hatunyi ambaye huishi mjini Nairobi, alifika bomani humo akiandamana na wanawe watano, kuomboleza kifo cha mumewe Stanley Ambai mwenye umri wa miaka na moja, lakini mke mdogo Caroline Mbaya alidinda kumuruhusu sio kuingia katika boma hilo ambalo kwa sasa liko chini ya ulinzi mkali wa maafisa wa polisi. Ujinga. Askari ndio wale mwanamke ndio huyo unaona vinye niko nilikuwa nimefungiwa hata nimeingia hapa kwa ajili yenu. Jana tulifukuswa usiku na watoto tulitafuta pahali pa kulala saa hii hatuna vinye tunaweza fanya. Tunatafuta usaidizi nizike mzee wangu na nipewe haki yangu. Ikiwa tu kuwa na mzozano kwa sababu mzee nikiwa Nairobi mimi naishi Nairobi. Sasa wakati kulikuwa alikufa kitiana wangu ndiye alikuwa naye. Mzee alikuwa na bibi mwingine. Huyu ni bibi wa sita. Kwa sababu kuna bibi wa pili, wa tatu, wa na watano. Huyu bibi aliolewa 2016. Mimi niliolewa 1991. Niko na watoto watano. Vijana watatu wasichana wawili. Kwa hivyo nilikuja hakika kama mume wangu maana niko na certificate ya kwamba huyu ni mume wangu. Mama huyo anadai kuwa kulingana na mila za jamii ya Waluya yeye kama mke mkubwa anafaa kuhusishwa kikamilifu kwenye mipango ya mazishi ya mumewe ila mke mdogo pamoja na baadhi ya jamaa wa marehemu na mzuia wakidai kuwa alikuwa ametalikiwa na mumewe kabla ya kifo chake. Amelipa mahari kwetu. Na mzee nilikuwa naishi na watoto Nairobi. Mzee akaniambia nilete watoto kwa boma yao. Wakati huyo mwanamke alitaka kuwa watoto mzee aliweka watoto aliweka watoto kwa gari wakakuja Nairobi. Kwa sababu alitandika huyu mtoto akapelekwa hospitali akiwa maututi kaimosi. Akachukua watoto akaniletea. Mimi nimekuja na watoto wangu nikitoka Nairobi ili nizike mzee wangu. Hiyo ndio kitu kimenileta hapa na nimefukuzwa hapa. Sub chief amekataa kunisaidia. Leo nimeraukia kwa chief amekataa kunisaidia. Nilienda polisi jana wakati nilifukuzwa. Polisi ya Ikambi. OCS aliniambia ya kwamba niende kotini ndio nitasaidiwa. Kumekuwa na issues kuhusu vile tutamzika, vile tutakaa na vile yani issues tu za hapa na kule lakini ndio tunajaribu kusolve. Kuna madhe hapa, ako na issues pia, walikuwa sana na dadi ya, ya tujui lakini hapa ni kwetu na ndio tunajaribu kukuja tujue tutakaaje. Watoto pia walikuwa naishi hapa lakini wakaenda Nairobi, sasa wamerudi hapa ni kwao, watakaa hapa. Oh, kenye mine zambia mamu, akuwe mstrong na simame na mimi, siya tuwezi muacha. Mimi nikiwa kijana wake siwezi muacha. Mzee akipelekwa hospitali nilikuwa na yeye. Hadi akipoteza maisha yake nilikuwa na yeye. Na mimi ndio nilimwandikisha huko. E, mimi ndio nilikuwa na yeye, mimi ndio nikambeba, nikamweka kwa mochari na nikamwandikisha. Mimi hata tumekaa na wazee mwili hayezi tolewa kama mama hajashughulikiwa. Kama kwa niseme mama wote cha niseme peke yake mamangu peke yake haiwezi zikwa kama mamia hajashughulikiwa hata hiyo mdogo anajua hata wote wanajua na mimi sina shida na mama yeyote kitu mimi nataka ni amani hapa baba yangu alikuwa mtu wa amani e, akuwa mtu wa vurugu hata hivyo, katibu wa kamati andalizi ya mazishi hayo, Friend League Chimakati, amesema wanafanya kila jitihada ili kuzima mzozo wa waki hawa wili, pamoja na kuhakikisha wote wanapata haki wakiwemo wanao. All the funerals run in Luyaland. There is a design where we mourn. And in, the, in our mourning, we have to have conflicts. The stature of a man of Mbai is a man of children and wives. In our culture, we recognize all wives. We recognize all children. The problem we have here is the younger wife is the one who has hosted Mbai. The first wife was not around when Mbai died. So what have we done? Our culture demands that the first wife has to have a place for mourning. The committee articulately gave three options that she operates here 
in a tent, number one. Number two, she was to operate in a land that Mr. Imbai bought separately, which is not far from this compound. Number three, she was to operate from uh, the, the, the grandmother's house. Then thereafter, we could have all resolutions on Sunday after burial. We will handle all the, all the children, all the wives equally under the same measure. So we cannot have five wives in this house. There is no politics here. These are family matters. So akuna kitu mtatuami. We know law. Our tatu wote ni wetu. Mabibi ni wetu. Shukran sana kwa kuwa nasi na kwamba bonyeza subscribe button hapo chini na bonyeza alama ya kengele ili uendelee kupata taarifa moto moto kutoka hapa Balendwe Media. Shukran na Mungu akuzidishie.